Hello everybody. We're going to try today and make an Easter card, a very simple card. So hang on to your plates. I hadn't realised that Easter was nearly upon us. So um, we're going to try and make this card so that everybody can have a go at it. Little ones might need a bit of a help with the initial shape of the eggs. The parents might have to help them with that. I was lucky because I found a template of an oval, and that's what we call that shape, in my workshop. The first thing you have to do is to decide on the size of your card that you're going to make. That is just computer paper. Um, but you can see from that that the egg shape has to fit onto your card. It's no good doing all that work and you can't find a piece of paper that's going to fit it. The first thing you do is to cut out your egg shape here. So you're going to draw an egg shape and you're going to cut it out. The next thing you do is you've got to colour it, make a pattern on it. So it's really cheerful and it's a kind of egg that you would like to get. So there are all sorts of patterns and designs that you could have a go at, but that's up to you. You can use felt tip pens or coloured pencils or paint, whatever you've got in hand to work with. We then have to draw and cut out this little chick shape. And I'll show you that on the black. There's our little chicken. Chick. So it wants to be a size that can fit to come out of our egg. So we have roughly that size. But it needs to have not only this top part here, but it has to have a part that's going to stick down inside the egg. So you do your little head of the chick, its shoulders, and then a piece at the bottom. The next thing you do on your egg is to draw a zigzag line across the middle as if it's broken. So this is your broken egg shape because the chick is going to come out of the egg. It may be that you're lucky and have some yellow things that you can use. I found bits of yellow tissue paper, sorry, bits of yellow tissue paper, and in my sideboard I found a yellow serviette. So I used the yellow serviette to tie, sorry, tear pieces like this, scrumple them. Lots of them, you have to do lots of them. So you can scrumple them up so that you make a chick. That is sort of sticking out and a little bit fluffy. So we make a chick that has crumpled yellow tissue paper on, but lots of you won't have anything yellow. So don't worry about it. You can just colour your chick yellow, put two black eyes and an orange beak. I cut out the um, orange beak and black eyes from a piece of the front of a magazine here. So you don't have to have orange paper and black paper. You can find a magazine and cut out those pieces. Okay. The next thing we do is, I've put this on with blue tack so that I can stick it in the end. So you've got your egg, you've got your chick, you've got this, which you've cut in half so that you've got two pieces, 
two pieces of egg which fit together like so. And our chip is going to pop out of the middle of it. All right? The chick, if you remember, had to have a piece which came down so that that will glue inside. I'll take that off because I need it to put my card together. I have do I have a nice black uh, piece of paper that helps you show things up but it isn't a particular nice colour for an Easter card but, but this is a, a card that I had in the drawer so I'm using that. You want to know where your egg is going to go. The first thing you do is you need some glue prick stick, something like that, and you've got to stick the top half of your egg on. Well, I'll have to do it down here, but you can see. You only need to stick the top half of it. That's a bit tricky for me on the side here, but right. So I've stuck the top part of the egg on. I'm that now going to stick the chick on and I've got to glue the back of it. But only the back of it at the bottom part. Okay, if I show you, there's the chick. And I've glued only the bottom part here because then I'm going to stick it on so that it's shoulders of the chick are here. And I'll lift him up a little bit and I'll press on. So he's loose at the top look there and then I've got to glue the bottom half of the egg. I'm going to glue the bottom half of the egg, but I don't glue the part that's broken at the top. So these zigzag cut shapes, I don't glue. I glue around the edge here. just gluing the very bottom of the egg not the middle part and then move that out of the way it's a bit tricky from this angle but we need to put the egg so we need to match it and then we can press round and there we've got our chick popping out of our egg and then you can do any kind of balloon writing and do Happy Easter. Have a go at it. It won't take long to do um, and I hope you enjoy it. Okay.